Hi Capricorn, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. Let's continue. First, let's shuffle the deck four times. Let's see what are the current energies. Both of you overthink a lot. There's this resistance to open up or indecision if there should be communication. You think a lot about being in a relationship again with each other to try again but not doing anything but just thinking and reflecting right now and just watching each other on social media or asking about each other what's up with each other's lives. What is affecting you in your subconscious right now? You feel stuck, you overthink a lot, you can't find a solution. You don't have that clarity yet about what to do in this situation, to stay there, to, to wait for them or not. You want more clarity, you want the complete truth from them. Now, what happened in the past? What was the challenge? There may have been either a disinterest, so you saw some disinterest from them, and... Uh, things from then didn't go well or there was a proposal and there was a rejection so, so something like that but an event or behavior that seemed to to have to have ended completely the relationship that's how it feels at least for both of you like it is very uh, it is uh, it cannot be restarted again that's how it feels. Let's hope it was not a third party uh, situation. Let's hope it was not a third party situation that they were interested in dating other people as well or were thinking about others. Yes, that's a high possibility as well. A third party situation. Or they may have not been 100% focused into that connection with you and they may have been thinking about other people. Now, how do you view the situation with them? You want to try again to see if the balance, harmony can be put into place. You still have lots of confusion, insecurities. Yes, I have the Moon card, the Queen of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords at the bottom of the deck. So there's a high possibility this person was not honest in the past. They may have cheated or lied or not very transparent and you have this feeling like they were hiding something and not telling you the complete uh, truth not the complete truth now let's see more details you fear the silence will continue you don't like that you want communication, you want more clarity. You are at crossroads now about what to do about this situation. And yes, this, uh, despite all those red flags and problems of the past, you want to give this another chance. There's confusion, but you want to believe in that connection. Now let's see about them. What are their energies towards you right now? They want to talk, they have attraction. Okay. Let's see one more card. They have a strong physical attraction towards you. They think the connection first should be healed. That you both should let it more time. So the clarity will come after some time passes. And uh, the first step would be to reconnect in a friendly way and to see if there's cooperation there. If you can be a teamwork and discuss together if that connection can grow better. They are very full aware there's love there and big potential to, to build a beautiful, uh, connection 
But first, you both should be transparent and straightforward with each other. There was definitely toxicity in that connection, unhealthy behaviors that completely shattered it and revealed that it was not built on something solid. Yes, a painful ending, unfortunately. I will continue this reading in the extended now with more details about what kind of feelings do they have towards you? How do they view you from the outside? What are their intentions at this moment? What about the energies? If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below this video. If you are watching this from your mobile phone, you can just click the title, the description box will expand, and at the top you can find the extended link. Thank you for watching, see you in the next reading, and bye for now.